This is a video you found in May on one of AOD's sock accounts. It says Truth's Friction 2 has been flagged down and terminated thanks to Felida again. And on there, in the message, you see Truth's Friction 2 has been terminated due to multiple or severe violations of our community guidelines. This is a fake, and let me show you how I know it's a fake. Here you see me logged into my own channel, Kalida the Geek, with a double three now. And I'm going to my old channel, Felida the Geek, with just E's. And once it's loaded, you will see the message it will actually give you is this account has been terminated. Blah blah blah. Not Felida the Geek, but this account has been terminated. The same will be true, and I will show you that right here, if you go to Truth's Friction 2. It also tells you, this account has been terminated. Isn't that quite interesting? Because that's how YouTube works. It tells you, this account has been terminated, for each and every terminated account. It never mentions the actual name. Interesting also to watch that the reason for the termination of Truth's Friction 2 has changed. So, I guess this account is very, very special because it got terminated twice for different reasons. And one time YouTube decided it was special enough to actually name it in the message? I don't think so. The reason why you see it is because they doctored the entire thing. That is why you do not see the URL on top. Because if they were to do that, it would clearly show you that that was created on their own computer. They fiddled with the HTML behind that to put the name Truth's Friction 2 in there. I remember stumbling across this video. Uh, Truth's Friction 2 terminated. Uh, I was just trying to see what lies they have conjured about me. The uh, D stamp buffalo and true fiction. So, um, I clicked the link, and um, <laughs> here's the funny part. Um, Truth's Friction 2 was still up at the time, um, I could still flick, but the, at the time when I had gotten my handycam, this one, and uh, I tried to reload the page, it took about 3 minutes, my handycam was packed away because I'm an idiot. Uh, it was no longer valid. I could not reload because then it has been terminated. I think that is very, very peculiar. Very, very strange, actually. Um, I wondered a bit about that. How could I get into the channel? Bef How could someone know that it that it was terminated? Is he a psychic? This uh, is just weird. The only way he could know it was going to be terminated if 
if his he had a hand in it. Um, stuttering, yeah, good. Uh, that's my take on it. Uh, I found that very interesting. Um, I know it's only personal testimony and stuff, but um, I'm wearing a hat, so I guess that makes it true. Uh, it, it is true. It could be a YouTube bug, but I don't think so. No. I think it's very, very unlikely that my catcher somehow is older or can go back and he couldn't and he could still make at the time to make a video before knowing this and uh, I actually downloaded the video but I don't know if the date is correct but here it is May 14th 2011 6 27 I'm, an, I'm a morning person so yeah Alright, this is the last time I'm making this video, because I'm using freaking Explorer to do it, and I hate Explorer. Third attempt. Okay, um, there's some stuff that happens when you try to go to a terminated account that has some people a little confused, so I'm just, I'm just showing them that they're, just to settle a little bit of a dispute here. Now, um, I just did a search for terminated YouTube accounts through YouTube and I got several videos but I used this one because it shows you a little more okay, clearly I know by what I'd now. like I to point these, out. Uh, page, user page. Now let me just skip ahead to the actual notice and if you look at this notice you'll see that it shows the channel name go back, go back, go back and pause. Um, it shows the channel name of the terminated account and it shows several reasons why the account was terminated. It has a lot of information there. Um, and I'm going to go to that channel name now and I kind of messed up. I didn't copy the name of the channel that I need to go to so I'm going to have to go back here in a second. I would have edited this out but I just didn't feel like it. Um, so now I'll just grab this terminated now, account I'm channel name. Uh, page, user page is down. Um, I'm going to post a couple pictures here in a second mm -hmm. of uh, the DMCA's that are against him. Uh, but if I find out anything or if he needs to contact me or post a video, uh, if you can do so. I'd be glad. And then I will try to go to this terminated account now. Go to this terminated account and paste. Come on now. Paste it. And then go. And looky there. The terminated account warnings all different. Now this does not mean that the gentleman who made that video photoshopped the image in his video. That just means either it's been a long time since that account was actually terminated so they're going to show you a different notice or there's been an update into, in the way that YouTube shows these notices now. I'm not sure which one but it's just something that happens. It doesn't mean that anyone's trying to be sneaky or trying to you know get up to something devious. It just means YouTube's showing you the information differently now. And I'm going to put those links down in the description bar so that you can try it for yourself. Alright? Alright. Y'all have a good day.